focus, keeping my mind sharp, you know, and uh, not getting sidetracked by this foolery, you know, so it's all about uh, turning all this into positivity and just, uh, you know, I can't wait, man, all that shit right now, they're going to be sucking our dick after, sorry for my language, excuse me, and to the LBGTQ, I didn't mean to say, I'm just talking, you know what I'm saying, but I love everybody, man, so at the, at the end of it all, man, it's just um, putting on a show for everybody. See, I just picked up my talk. He's like, you got a bit of stoicism to you. I saw that camp life where you've been journaling, you've been doing Tai Chi and stuff. Does that help you out in moments like this where a lot of stuff is going on? Yeah, because I got to think about it, you know. Is it really worth it? Mm. Is it really worth hitting his father and then getting getting it with him right now? Or is it better just to wait a couple more days, get in the ring, do it the right way, mm. and just get it done? You know what I'm saying? You better fuck this like, motherfucker off, bro. Oh, that's, that's a given. Please, bro. That's a given. Bro. That's a given. And then get out the ring and fuck up his father, too. <laughs> So yeah, he's making this back up, so it was a middle of an interview and there. Uh, it's a bit of a commotion with your dad and, and Cambosis team there. What did you make of that? Oh, uh, you know, hey, this is what it is. It's something that what, that what people are looking forward to. You know what I'm saying? See, man, this is what it's about. We ain't fucking fooling around here. Excuse my language. Um, I gotta keep more PG. But uh, I look at it like this, man. It's just all about, you know, it's that tension, man. And uh, this, is, this, is not a, this is not a show, man. We're really, really doing this. Just take him out. Just take my father out. He's the one that he gets to. He gets to. You know what I'm saying? If it wasn't for my boxing, man, I'd be the same. You know what I'm saying? That's just how it is. Mm. We were talking about Josh Taylor. Okay, he's gone outside the building anyways. His dad. But we're talking about Josh Taylor. He told me last week in Las Vegas, you're using his name for clout, Tia. Apparently I use everybody's name for clout. <laughs> Apparently I use everybody's name for clout. But I mean, look what it's done for me, right? I guess I'm not using clout on anybody, man. I'm just going out there just making the fights happen. I mean, people write to me on social media. People tell me what fights they're going to have. And I'm like, okay, what's the greatest fights that we could do? And I think that's the best thing that I, I could say, man. I'm not clout chasing nobody. You know, I'm doing what I want to do. They got to do what they're told to do. That's the difference. You don't see Josh Taylor with his own promotion. I got my own promotion. You don't see Josh Taylor making his own ESPN contract deal. I did that. You know what I'm saying? So, like, man, if anybody's cloud chasing, it's him. I think we just got to wrap up here, T.O. They want you. All right. T.O. Well, Thank you so you know, talk to me a little bit about uh, Bruce Lee and his influence on you, man. I was watching huge, that. Huge, huge, huge freaking influence. I mean, that guy is my master. I'll be real with y'all, man. That, man, all these guys, man, that paved the way. They all my masters. They my teachers. Uh, I know it sounds crazy, but it's not, man. It's um, it's really how it is. Um, to know Bruce Lee, how how he moves and how he talks, and the documentaries that they put out for him. Um, be water and all those things man uh, when you really look at it and dissect it that man was so woke that he knew how to keep everything calm like right now I could you know gotta breathe you gotta remind breathe. me of that moment you gotta, you remind, you gotta be that still country. like water mm. you know you gotta be still like water but uh, you know um, I would love to you know keep on but I, everybody wants yeah, to yeah, I they don't want no more attention you. so I, you. I appreciate you guys yeah, man and happy Thanksgiving Thank to each and one of you uh, enjoy your families love your families you never know when they're gonna be gone, man. So, so just uh, and cherish that moment. You know, cherish those times. And uh, to everybody, tune in November 27th, live on the Zone. Get the app now. You guys don't want to miss it. It's a takeover. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Thank you.